Hello my dear children, once again welcome back to the class and let's continue the class with the exercise D. Till 20 we have finished the in previous class and let's start the exercise D. In that the first one comes, Suman has 12 chocolates. Her mother gave her 9 more chocolates. How many chocolates does she have now? Okay, so here in this exercise you can find out the word problems, mixed word problems. Okay, so here the first one is Suman has 12 chocolates. Her mother gave her 9 more chocolates. So how many chocolates does she have now? Okay, so now what we have to do children? Yes, so we need to add this, isn't it? We need to add this number that is 12 and 9 then we will get how many chocolates does she have now who sumana okay yes now let's do it now let's write the digit that is 12 so sumana has 12 chocolates and her mother gave how many chocolates again 9 chocolates now we need to add this Okay, this is the ones place and this is tens place, isn't it? Now, 9 is a greater number, 2 is a small number. So, 9 keep in a mind, 2 in a hand. 9 after 10, 11. So, we need to write here 1 and 1 more carry over. Okay, now 1 plus 1 is how much children? 2. So, the, so that how many chocolates one has now? Total? Yes. 21 chocolate she have now. Okay. So the number of chocolate is 21. So here we got the answer 21. Now let's move to the next page number 134. And that the second one is for a party 48 ice creams were bought. When 8 more guests came so, 8 more ice creams were bought. How many ice creams were bought all together? So, before solve the question, you need to read the questions properly, children. That is very important. Okay. So, before we go into solve the question, you should understand the question better. So, for a party, 48 ice creams were bought. When 8 more guests came, Eight more ice creams were brought. Okay. So, how many ice creams were brought all together? So, here ice cream spelling is wrong. He is there. C R E A M S. It should be a M S. Okay. Make it correct, children. Okay. Now, so 48 ice cream plus 8 ice cream. We need to add. Okay. Now, let's do a rough work. Yes, we need to write 48 plus 2. Okay, this is 10, 1's place and this is 10's place. So, they have brought first 48 ice cream for the party and afterwards 8 more ice cream they bought for again 8 guests. Isn't it? So, now we need to calculate how many ice creams were brought all together. Okay, so 8 plus 8 how much children? Yes, 1, 8 you have to keep in your mind. 1 more 8 it should be in your hand. So, after 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Isn't it? 16 we got. Right? Yes. So, 6 we should write here. That is it. Which is in a 1's place. And which is in a 10's place. That is 1. We need to write here. Okay. Now, 4 plus 1. How much children? 5. So, total. How many chocolates they... I mean, how many ice creams they bought? 50. 6 ice creams. They bought 56 ice creams all together. Okay. Now let's move to the third question. So the third question is Anu had 17 sweets. She gave 9 sweets to her friends. How many sweets are left with her now? Okay. Anu had 17 sweets. How many sweets? 17 sweets. So she gave 9 sweets to her friends. 
in that 17 sweets she gave 9 sweets to her friends now we have to find out how many sweets are left with her now now what we have to do children to get the answer yes exactly we need to subtract the numbers from 17 to we need to subtract 9 let's do a rough work so write the digits like this 17 minus 9 this is a ones place and this is tens place now 7 minus 9 is it possible to do children no it is not possible to subtract the number because 7 is a small number 9 is a big number so now what we have to do we need to borrow 1 right and the same number we have to write here that is 7 now how much is there 17 now it has become 17 now we need to strike out this number 17 minus 9 how much children yes calculate 9 after you have to count the number till 17 comes now start to calculate 9 after 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 so how much we got children answer is 8 we got right yes so we got here 8 17 minus 9 is equal to 8 now in a tens place come to tens place how much is there in a tens place nothing isn't it because this one we have borrowed ones place now it is here zero nothing is there so we don't have anything to write in a tens place so we need to write only eight so that means how many sweets does anu have now yes anu have now total eight sweets among 17 sweets she has distributed nine sweets to her friends now how many left now eight sweets is it clear children yes so today i'm going to end my class here itself children so let's continue the class in the next video thank you see you bye